carbon footprint of construction. It is 40% of the world CO2 emissions, but also adaptation, resilience. You name it, we have seen you know, the fire in Canada, we have seen the typhoon in Vietnam just 10 days ago. We have seen many, many heat waves around the world, so a lot of extreme weather. It's not just about global warming, it is risking the lives and the construction stock of so many places around the world. So this is why we have decided to focus this particular panel on truly the resilience, the adaptation of our buildings. New conditions are there, new climate conditions. We have to anticipate again, not only for the climate, but also to truly secure the lives of so many people around the planet.